formerly married David and Georgia Cotton despise one another and regret their divorce, which took place 20 years ago. After Lily, their daughter, completes law school, she and fellow graduate Ren take a trip to Bali. Their tour boat abandons them when they are snorkeling off the coast, but a young Balinese seaweed farmer named Ged comes to their aid. Ged and Lily got along well. 37 days later, Lily emails David and Georgia to inform them that she is getting married to Ged and will be relocating to Bali permanently, abandoning her plans to pursue a legal career. To attempt and persuade Lily that she is rushing into things and making the same error that they did, David and Georgia strike a truce. Paul, Georgia's lover, who planned to fly this flight and then surprise Georgia by traveling back to Bali a few days later, turns out to be their pilot on the journey to Bali. Lily and Ged receive verbal approval from David and Georgia, but they are covertly working on a Trojan horse scheme to destroy the wedding from within. They steal the couple's wedding rings as part of their plan, which they immediately replace. While hiding his concerns from Lily, Ged quickly accuses David and Georgia. As they follow out this strategy, David and Georgia start to heal their relationship. Additionally, they get to meet Ged and his big extended family and realize how much he cares for Lily. A snake bite in the temple of Tana Lot interrupts the first of Paul's marriage proposals to Georgia, and an unintentional headbutt stops the second. Paul then shows up and surprises Georgia with a series of marriage proposals. When Lily finds out the rings were stolen, she tells them to accept the wedding or leave. She also confronts Ged, who had just admitted that he had suspected Georgia and David of taking the reins. David and Georgia make the decision to accept Lily's decision after realizing they may lose her forever if they don't. In keeping with Balinese tradition, the wedding continues. Ged interrupts the wedding ceremony to ask David and Georgia for their blessing once again, threatening not to proceed with it until they accept. The couple is about to ceremonially stab a knife through a pandan leaf mat to seal their union. David gets up and tells the couple that while they have their blessing, they don't actually need it. He also claims that if he and Georgia had listened to all of their own critics, friends David's and Georgia's parents, respectively, they would not have ever conceived Lily. And regardless of how their marriage turned out, Lily is a part of their life and makes them both happier. Touched, Lily and Ged finish the ceremony and exchange vows to become husband and wife. 